Now, a notorious gangster turned author has been holding talks with one of the UK's brightest young actors in our part of the world today, Bernard O'Mahony, who's a former member of the Essex Boys firm and has written several books on his experiences in the criminal underworld, met with former EastEnders and Shameless star Jodie Latham in Ferry Hill today. They're in discussions over a project to see Bernard's book, Fog on the Tyne, about a real-life gang war on Tyneside, turned into a movie. Well, our reporter Andy Bell, he's the right one, met the former gangster in the new cafe for a chat about his past and the new project. Got a bit of a notorious past. I have, yeah. I, I used to run nightclub doors in Essex in the 90s and late 80s. And um, my partners weren't content with just running the doors. They started importing drugs from um, Europe. And uh, that all came to a sticky end in December 1995. They were lured to um, a remote farm track in a Range Rover. They thought they were going to meet other drug dealers, but it was a trap and... Um, they were all shot through the head and it seemed a good time for me to retire from that, from that world. And um, that brought an end to my criminal career, really. To be honest, it wasn't a shock because they were out of control, you know, like a lot of young people who think they're earning lots of money and think that they're controlling things. They started to believe that they were untouchable and, um, you know, a lot of people said they're going to get it. Do you know what I mean? And throughout history, all gangs end up... No gang's ever been successful in history, you know what I mean? Everyone goes on a bit of crazy, how successful are you? How can you be successful when you spent 30-odd years in prison, do you know what I mean? You're just a complete mug and that's the way every gang goes, you know what I mean? Do you look back on that time with heavy regret? Honest answer, I mean, I should say, yeah, I regret it, but honest answer's no. I mean, what's done's done and... You just move on, you know, and, and, and try and learn from things and not make the same mistakes, you know what I mean? Now, this morning, we're, we're here in the cafe for a, a reason. There's a project underway, is that right? Yes. I wrote a book about two years ago called Fog on the Tyne, about the, the underworld in the northeast. And um, Jody read it, and um, he said, oh, it's a fantastic story. And it sort of got punted around various production companies. We've had interest from um, a television company who's on, talking about making a series based on the book, a six-part series, and a television a film company who are about making a full-length sort of feature film. And Jody wants to be part of that, so he's just come up today to go through a few things and, you know, talk things over. Really. He was um, Philip Gallagher in Shameless, Frank Gallagher's son, and uh, he was in EastEnders as um, a pretty brutal witness... Pimp, I think, is the best way to describe him. There's a couple of associations with Manchester in the book, and he'd play a Manchester villain, base villain, because he's from the North West. And will you um, have a role in that? Or is it simply a case you've written the book, you hand that over, or you're looking to play a part in the production? Well, dealing with the media is a bit like dealing with villains, you know what I mean? You write a book, you sell the book to them and you've sold your soul to the devil, really. They, they do what they want with it, basically. You know. yeah, you're involved to a degree, but they're paying the money, they, they have the final say, yeah. I'll tell you what, I guarantee everybody pays their bill in that cafe. Uh, you wouldn't mess, would you? Andy Bell, our reporter, you wouldn't mess with him. <laughs> uh, in the next hour, we're going to hear an interview with the actor Geordie Latham as well uh, about that. So uh, stick around. BBC Tees with Neil Green tonight until...